What's going on YouTube? Kamikaze Von Doom here with another Division 2 video. Now this is going to be your Farm This Today video for Friday, April 3rd. Shout out to the DoD like always. I am Kamikaze Von Doom. If you guys enjoy this in any way, shape, or form, make sure you hit that thumbs up. If you have any questions, comments for me at all, make sure you hit me up in the comment section below. And if you are new to this channel, make sure you subscribe and ring that notification bell. That way you get notified each and every time I bring you another Division 2 video. But alright, so farm this today for April 3rd. We've got some pretty good locations. So, let's get into it. Now, starting off with New York, there was nothing really promising in New York, so I'm not even going to bother. However, the Dark Zone and the Light Zone in DC are pretty good farming. Starting off with the Dark Zone, you have Backpacks in DZ East. That's pretty good. Backpacks are not the easiest to come by. And then also you have Assault Rifles in DZ South. Everyone knows that Assault Rifles are going to get a buff here soon, so you might as well try to stock up on some God Rolls while you can, and the Dark Zone is a great place to farm. Now, for the Light Zone, uh, you have Fenris over here at Lincoln Memorial. Everyone loves to farm that uh, mission. But for me, I'm going to highly recommend the three hot spots for this manhunt for the week. I believe it's Venus. Let me double check. Yep, Venus. So the cool thing about these three locations for Venus, you go to your targeted loot, you have Providence over here in Judiciary Square for the control points and the bounties and the stronghold. You also have backpacks for District Union Stronghold, which is huge. You have skill attachments in downtown east and gloves in that Grand Washington Hotel. So these two sections are great for farming right now, especially today. And then below that, this is the last section for the Venus Manhunt. You have uh, masks for Viewpoint Museum and Gilligard for Jefferson Trade Center. Now, Gilligard is a great way to farm for the Point Man chess piece. The Point Man chess piece has perfect vanguard and it is a Gilligard chess piece. So I'd highly recommend you guys try to go for that because that's a great chess piece to pick up. But these three locations are huge right now. Not only that, but you can do the control points, you can do the bounties, and then you can do the missions and all of this is going to get you some pretty good loot. The only thing I'm not a huge fan of is the Araldi Holdings and Federal Triangle, but it's not like you really need to do too much open world right there. You could do the two missions and then do the rest of the manhunt and the other two zones. Um, but yeah, that's not too bad. Now, quick overview. Backpacks, DZ East. Assault Rifles, DZ South. Fenris at Lincoln Memorial. Gilligard at Jefferson Trade Center, Mask at Viewpoint Museum, Backpacks at District Union, and Gloves at Grand Washington Hotel. If you're going to do control points and bounties, I'd highly recommend Judiciary Square for Providence and Downtown East for skill attachments. These are all pretty good places to farm, and they've got it all centered around that manhunt, so you can knock out both of these and get all that XP from the manhunt as well. Not bad farming for today, you guys. I'd highly recommend you guys check that out. And yeah, I'm Kamikaze Von Doom. If you guys enjoy it in any way, shape, or form, find this helpful, informative, anything, let me know in the comment section below and hit that thumbs up. If you're new to this channel, I hope you subscribe. But remember, hit that notification bell, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs>